Hi everyone, you're in Endurance Laser Lab. Today I want to show you how you can change your laser power by changing power of the laser and by changing frequency. So we got a PVM uh, board uh, and now we're going to show you. We're using 6 watt infrared endurance laser with a new board, still developing. So let me show how does it work. So you can see that uh, the light is blinking so it's it's not stable and when it's even in focus it doesn't almost doesn't cut anything so we had 10% uh, frequency and 10 11% uh, power uh, intensity so we can actually increase uh, frequency by uh, clicking this button and you see that it's it doesn't blinking it's uh, it's, it's, it's became constant the power the beam is constant without any blinking. Now we can also add uh, more power and the laser will uh, shine brighter. As you can see it's even here it's more and more bright. Now you cannot see because it's burned inside but uh, here you can see that it's, it's became more powerful. So this is like 100% and uh, I think it's like, like this. Okay, yeah, we have to go backwards. So, yeah, it's restarted. <laughs> so we need to start again by increasing the power. Okay, so 40%, uh, 60, 70, 80, 90, 99. And the frequency is also to 100. So it'll be, it'll be maximum power okay. so this tool you can actually use when you want to increase your laser power by adding impulsive mode so you can actually do it like uh, like this so you have an impulsive mode and it, it works 100% uh, so the, the lasers are in impulsive mode they can work a little bit better but uh, keep in mind that frequency and intensity, these parameters are pretty much uh, not equal, but uh, uh, the nature of these parameters could be, uh, could be the same. So if you want like blinking, you probably need to, to change the, uh, this power parameter. So this is due to ratio. So as you can see now, going to have something like this. Okay, so we have it. But still you need to know data sheet for your laser diode to make sure that the parameters of frequency and due to ratio are optimal. So the laser diode gives a maximum power and it's working in impulsive mode. But uh, yeah, I think it's a cool idea to add something like this to lasers and we're going to present it in our new products. And uh, we already have it in la our laser box where you have uh, the Arduino board that you can actually program pretty much the same as I showed you here. So hope that you like this video. Please share it with your friends and have wonderful engraving.